hello welcome and welcome back to my channel glory to jesus honor to mary and joseph from pageantry to convent mexican beauty queen becomes a nun in 2017 a beauty queen came to abuse the internet when she decided to enter a congregation a year after being crowned as a title holder of her native town Esmeralda Solis Gonzalez was crowned as a queen of Valle de Guadalupe in Mexico in 2016, a year after her coronation. She became a postulant with the Poor Claire Missionary Sisters of the Blessed Sacrament. In an interview with the Catholic News Agency, Gonzalez shared that, I was very happy with everything I had. But it does not compare with the happiness that God now places in my heart. The discovery of the vocation to which she had been called was always present in her life as a little thorn, Esmeralda added. I realized that I had to make room in my life to know what it was that God had planned for me. In the process of discerning my vocation, there was also fear and doubts, but the love that our Lord was showing every day made me overcome any feeling of discouragement. She acknowledged the difficulty of the process she added she decided to take, but according to her, if you go and take God's hand, you will always be able to take the next step. Even, even though new to the congregation as a postulant, the first step is becoming a religious sister. She still managed to discover that in religious life, every new day is a new beginning and a new opportunity to extend the kingdom of God. This involves making a lot of sacrifices, but they are always rewarded with happiness. It is true that the reality and the supposed happiness that the world sells is very attractive, but it is necessary to fix your eyes on what lasts. You mustn't be afraid. If God is calling you, he will take care of everything. All you need to do is receive him with a lot of peace, joy, and confidence. I believe here is a big excuse that is responsible for truncating the true happiness that only God can offer, she said. I have been in religious life very little time, but I truly have been very happy. May the story of Esmeralda Gonzalez encourage us to discern on our calling in life and not to be afraid to respond to it. Regina Chen.